Okay. Oh, there, there we go. Yeah, the mister was just weird because the HDMI wasn't plugged in to begin with. It's very strange. Yeah, this already looks wrong, this wheel. This wheel already looks a little too nice. <laughs> Yeah, I feel like his pants are already... Let's see, one second. The side of it looks weird. I'm gonna double check. Yeah, it's like, is it, is it doing it? Yeah, yeah, I turned it on. Cause yeah, that wheel looked wrong. The wheel's supposed to look like a fucking mess on that screen. <laughs> and that texture on the uh, board, uh -huh. you can like make it out at all at this angle. Yeah. PS1 games, they're supposed to go to mesh. Do you, do you think it breaks if I turn it off? Oh, it does not. I'm gonna back out to the wheel. I feel like that is still way too crisp for the wheel. The question is, when you turn it off, does it work? Right. Because it might not. Dude, suck. Barely Ollie. 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 Yeah, I know, right? That's why you plays the burn. To quality. No, I I like it. It's just weird. It's giving me PTSD for trying to get all the gaps. Ugh. Yeah, that no. those sort of things and these are always bad. Okay. But I guess it went down because I was holding down when I. Damn it. Yeah, boy. What's up? Just it popping up with you're cool, and I'm like, I didn't do anything. But yeah, that's oh. that's how it changes it to a more unreal like texture filtering. So instead huh. of wiggling and being at the edge the whole time, yeah, it like dithers it and it properly fills the space. Man, that's weird. That's not huh. how PS One's supposed to look. That's so strange looking. Everything's just sort of flashing now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I kind of, because you can see the dithering in the texture. Uh-huh. I'll punch in for chat so they can have a little bit easier of a time. So you see how you get the vertical jaggies going on in that texture? That's 100% because of this, because the original looked like that. That's weird. Yeah, it's so weird not to see, you know, the big blocks. Like, you know, we could turn off of dithering it. and make it a little bit easier to just see it. Yeah, that's interesting because it's adding vertical lines that are like... Yeah, I don't think it lo really looks better. Like, it just... It looks weird. When he, when he did this, he, he, did, he literally described it as, I added a texture filtering feature just like... Let me make that widescreen. <laughs> fill, this, fill this widescreen. Um... Like Unreal Engine 1. And so it's not like it's the best, but it does actually fix some of the problems with the PS1 texture filter filtering or lack thereof. And then Tony Hawk's the loudest fucking game ever. Yes. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and move on. Uh, I feel like Metal Gear Solid with the faces could be pretty good. It could be pretty good. Unreal Tournament 99 mass dither. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, the filtering is definitely that. I think he'll bring this back in uh, his next game. At the South by Konami. Darn it. That's the police knots theme. Oh, yeah. It's the what? first riff from it. I always associate it as that. Right. But... Play Vagrant Story, you cowards. <laughs> I mean, we already played the first 20 minutes. Why would we do it again? I get to see it. In That's never. <laughs> One game from now. Yeah, it looked wrong as hell without this. What okay, if it just see if looked blocky and fucking terrible? 
Splish splash. Weapons disposal facility on Shadow Moses <laughs> Island in Alaska's Fox Archipelago. <laughs> Snake, stop. Stop saying that. Splish splash. Forces, being led by members of Foxhound. They're demanding that the government turn over the remains of Big Boss. And they say that if their demands are not met within 24 hours, they'll launch a nuclear weapon. It's cool that Kojima's the guy who really likes movies, but also has ideas for video games. <laughs> That's pretty cool that he's like that. DARPA chief Donald Anderson and the president of Armstead, Kenneth Baker. Both are being held as hostages. Secondly, you're to investigate whether or not the terrorists have the ability to make a nuclear strike. To stop them if they do. What's the stupid sexy day? <laughs> we'll approach the disposal facility by sub. And then we'll launch a one-man SDV. The land two got dark. <laughs> yes. Oh yeah, I so said up on the D-pad skips that. Did Weird. you know that? No, I, I didn't, didn't know that. I didn't know hitting directions would skip it. Hey, Bob, if you want to play a little bit of that. Sure. I'm going to change our title. <laughs> Splish splash. <laughs> It's gonna be really weird when out of nowhere we're just like, oh, oh, everyone voted for this Metal Gear, bud. Cleo, stop! Guilty, your honor. No plat for Balan. I mean, that is true. The no plat for Balan Balan's good. Yes. Yeah, just donate another forty-five dollars. Cleo, please. Cleo, ease. Bert Stewart. I don't know, the texture filtering is really weird. Yeah, right. Because in some ways it looks better, and in other ways it looks worse, and I'm curious how it looks on a CRT. Hmm. Between that and the dithering, I feel like it's it's a little nasty, right? This is Snake. Colonel, can you hear me? Triangle twice, I think. Really? No. Huh. I guess that's only in two. No, that's... That's like... <laughs> Have a good night, Spiff and Fox. <laughs> okay, one second. What's up? Get, get into those close-up shots again. I really like the one that's the top of this damn thing. Because oh, it really go. zooms in on it. Let's go back. I meant, I went the one where you're on just barely the far side of this, and then it just shows the top of the thing next to you. Ah. Where it's super fun. zoomed in. Hey, oh, well, that, that one really close. That one gets us some fucking textures on screen. Oh my god, that looks so weird. Because there's that, all those vertical lines going. Yeah. And the PS1 dithering on top of it. Right. It's really weird. I really appreciate the 16 by 9 though. Much appreciated. There we go. Circle, right? Yeah, circle. Yeah. I only know because of MGS2. I've played MGS2 a lot more than one. Yeah, me too. You know why? This is fucking awesome. Hey, real quick. What's up? That thing you were just looking at down to the left. That thing? Yeah, that thing. Zoom in again. Okay, now change it off of the dithering. The filtering, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, then cha okay, and drop this and zoom out again. I want to see how that looks. It it wiggles less. It's more consistent when you zoom on a completely perpendicular plane. Don't worry about that. Definitely translates to other results. But it like, I feel like the filtering looks a little nicer with the other thing. Yeah. Yeah, I think in this case, because this looks pixelated and terrible. Yeah, it's super pixely. Turn um, turn it back on. Like zoom in and turn it back on. Because I'm really just looking at, yeah, that. Uh-oh. I was looking at a wall. Can you stop? It's called dithering, Snake. Dithering, huh? I don't know. It, I feel like it just adds... You still see the blocks, but then they add, like, more random convoluted 
lines going through it, and I don't think that necessarily looks better. <sighs> are we are we on dithering on or off? We're yeah, on, right? Texture, yeah, texture filtering's on. Sorry, I keep calling it dithering because that's literally what it's doing at a filter level. Yeah, I think for me the problem is that when you zoom in and out on a flat plane, it just looks weird as everything like wiggles. And if there's one thing the PS1 didn't need, <laughs> more wiggling. <laughs> more wiggling. <laughs> and the filtering's turned off now, right? I believe I turned it back on the... Okay. No, it's off. Yeah, it's yeah. off. I was like, that, that, that looks like the chunky pixels that the PS1 has. And turn it back on. Yeah, I feel like on a CRT especially, this would kind of look better. Yeah, maybe on a CRT. If only we had some way to check. Oh, oh whoops. What was that noise? I'm, I'm really good, good at Metal Gear Solid 1. I remember all the buttons and everything. This is going to look really good in 16x9 on the CRT box. Yes. Especially when it's squeezed back to 4x3 and it just looks wrong. Yeah. Here I go, turning again. Uh, lean against that wall. This wall? Yeah, maybe if you get to a corner. No, it doesn't bring it in. What about the other corner? Yes. Okay. Now if you could pause that. Oh, it's so dark in the CRT. I can't see it until you unpause it. Man. <laughs> Man, Snake, you really lost weight over here on the CRT. Oh, whoops. I had turned on auto fire because I was holding the button. So you're telling me you're up as rapid fire right now? Because <laughs> you were holding up when you pushed. Yes. That's really good. So here, let me do something. Sure. This, this will make it easy. Oh no, you did it again. Yeah, I'm trying to go up until it just cycles back. He turns sure it off. did add a lot of intervals. Holy shit. Dude. Oh, it's not turning it on or off. It's just adjusting the length. Yeah. You can't rapid fire up, apparently. Weird. On the core, you can okay. only rapid fire real buttons. I guess he took uh, the, the My Life and Gaming video where they said you can't nail the exact rapid fire nature of the controllers to heart okay pause when that's oh that dude that makes it stop outputting to the crt entirely see oh yeah it's completely blank on the crt right now you guys so that didn't help us at all what board is your mister is it analog or is it digital I'm curious because i'm thinking about getting one we have the analog add-on which only makes sense if you have if a you have CRT. A crt yeah that's it but it is using both at once, though. We got the CRT yes. going out in this. But, but the thing is, like, it only makes sense to get the analog one if you have a CRT, yeah, period. Yeah, but the thing I want to say, curious, because I'm thinking about getting one. I don't want to block out streaming, but with, I also want to play on CRT. So, yeah, you can do both. Yeah, you can do both. So the texture filtering actually doesn't work when you... Uh, when you have it freeze frame like that, see? Yeah. It's not doing anything. Yeah, you don't get to see it in real time. Oh, God. So if we get get back under the thing and, and Sarah something on the scope, then you can uh -huh. do it more easily. Ah, uh, scope. What is it, Snake? I brought mouthwash? <laughs> Why would I do that? Am I expecting to meet some hot babes? Well, my niece is there. Awkward silence. <laughs> uh, yeah, that texture filtering does just obliterate this. Look at it. Look at all these nice sharp lines on this crate, right? Uh huh. Don't look over there. It's really not that helpful. <laughs> just look at how it just yeah. turns it into yeah, a it's mess right. because it's vertical lines being dithered. Right? Like, I don't think that's good. Really, at the end of the day, really what we actually need is to perspective correct these fucking textures. Right. Which I think... Weirdly enough, this does help mitigate how obvious that problem is. Yes, yeah, Aqua, obviously Yuji was found guilty. <laughs> There's no fighting it. Uh, but 
how does his ass look filtered? <laughs> ah, finally filtered ass. But yeah, it's definitely like it's does interesting. The, all, it's interesting, but all the textures are designed around the way it does it normally. Right in this game, because Kojima, Kojima's team's on top of it. Right. Many games, it's it is what it is. Uh, I'm gonna turn off the 16 by 9 so we can see it on the CRT properly. Okay. And then I'm gonna take us to another game. Uh, yeah, no, you you want to see people. Tenchu? Who's Oh, Doctor Dr. O. o! Hey, welcome. We just uh we just finished playing Bland Wonderland all the Wonder World. Oh my god. All the way through. Hello, Doctor O streamers. Yes, welcome in. People probably know me. I am the person who runs Gigaboots and hangs out in the chat. Uh we are checking out the Mr. FPGA Consoles PS1 core. They added texture filtering at Unreal Engine 1 style. <laughs> Do we let the intro roll? I'm trying to remember. The Tenchu 3 intro is the iconic one. It is. Opinion. This one intro I remember being okay, but it's not going to have anything with texture filtering. It's just going to be them looking around in the forest. But everybody loves it. Who doesn't love it? Oh, we love Tenchu 2, Wordito. Oh yeah, the Tenchu 2 is great. We, we filled too many PS1 memory cards with bad levels. <laughs> yes, very bad I levels. I will hand that to you. It is the age. Um, but for anyone who doesn't know, pretty soon, by the end of this month, allegedly, uh, the PS1 core for the Mr. Retro FPGA console thing is going to be publicly accessible to everyone. This thing's amazing. Yeah. If you don't have a Mr., I highly recommend it. It's an amazing, great way to play retro games. It feels like real hardware because it's hardware emulation instead of software. And they've added PS1. So everything that's... PS1 gen and older, excluding things other than the PS1 from its gen. You can play on it. It's really great. Um, oh, wait. Where'd they put this thing? The texture filter's there. You just oh. didn't notice. Oh. So we actually have this right now on the TV, which is also in the capture over here. But we've got it going to a CRT at the same time. And we're checking out this new feature where they added Unreal Engine 1 style texture filtering. It yeah, looks yeah, it just, it just it just looks weird. Yeah, it's like adding these extra lines. Artifacts. Uh, yeah, artifacts that aren't there. Like, shouldn't be there at all. Yeah, which the PS1 does that enough. It's got the dithering. Once right. the Saturn core gets done, I think I'll finally bite. Matto, I feel like the PS1 core is going to take a long time. And I feel like the once the PS1 core, core or, sorry, Saturn core is done. Stairs, sorry, I meant to say Saturn. As I instruct you. Once the Saturn core is done, the demand's gonna shoot through the roof. But yeah, thank you, do doc thank you, Doctor O. Sorry, yeah, my mods so are gone. I, I forgot to. Yes. Forgot Give to shout, shout you out. out. Yeah, I love Doctor O. For people who don't know, Doctor O is one of my most viewed uh, streams. In fact, I don't know if Doc saw the tweet, because of course we're really busy on Twitter. We have tons of content coming out that we have to announce. Yeah. And pictures of my cat to show people. Like for example, right now. Oh, that's not the gameplay. That's it. Look at that picture of my cat. Danny's a cat. Anyway. Going back to the stream. Hell yeah. Um, but yeah, it, Dr. O probably missed it. Late last year, you know when Twitch does that yearly thing? Yeah. I think Dr. O was like my m number three most viewed stream. <laughs> he does a good stream. Yeah, no, great stream. Great, great stream. You must master the tools I think the, the number nature. one problem Pick every sure Twitch streamer must select. deal with is that they will never have a better way to great raider, greet raiders than Dr. O. Right, no, it's impossible. I it, feel ashamed that we're just <laughs> sitting here getting, getting invaded by Dr. O and we, we have nothing. I know. We could say, hey guys, welcome in. We play lots of retro games and, and new games and we try and have fun. We, we stream at least twice a week for an insane amount of hours. For example, we're 12 and a half in on this one. Right. On Monday, we'll be doing Pokemon Days. It will be Pokemon 3rd Gen. But yeah, uh, we do a lot of PS1, a lot of PS2. We're setting up... Um, we got that stream goal up there for me to get a working car because in order to work for the psychotic amount of hours I work, I need a way to get to what is going to be my next place I live, temporarily, to Bob's house, which will have our equipment in the future. But anyway. Those will incur death stream months where people will get to vote on what themes we do for the death stream some of them are there's the good half in the evil half the good half is stuff like specific franchises and the evil half is like jank ps2 action games 
times. <laughs> we have to beat like seven of them in a single month, all in a single stream. <laughs> yeah, Yuji, we did the vote, Mukbun. Yuji got the firing I am squad. Ready to be a ninja. You know, I sat here for a moment. I'm like, why do I hear double? Here, I, this is, I, me too. I was like, all oh, right, TV. But you have much to learn before. Oh, good, Colonel. Here, a ninja. yeah, we went from one Whoa. game with Colonel to another game with Colonel. Yeah, we can. I think I put Soul Reaver on it. Yeah, Bob, can you uh, pull up Soul Come Reaver? Back. Yeah, sure. Jank PS2 action game. Surely there is no such thing. What are you talking about? Bob owns too many, too many for us to say it doesn't exist. Soul. Oh no, I Wait. forgot Soul Reaver. Damn it. I guess the answer to your question is no. <laughs> <laughs> what is there anything else that we should try? Have a good night, Sandwich Peddler. Um, on the core, like yeah. in general? No, yeah, any other games that we we got on here we want to jump to. I did want to see Ridge Racer Type 4. I'm pretty interested in like how the street textures and stuff look like that. Yeah. In fact, that it might be more pleasant there than it is here. Maybe. We'll have to see. Is Tekken 3 on the SSD? Is that there? I think Thanks that to was there. Snow. I mean, it's, if you want to be fighting, you can go Star Gladiator. Why are you so bother with Tekken 3? It's so flattering to be followed by people who are in Dr. O's chat all the time. <laughs> that feels weird to say, but I'm just like, what a great thing. I don't know. <laughs> Sorry. It is Twitch law. We have to stick with the intro to see the smile. Okay, okay, you're right. It is very strong. I bet Texture Filter is going to make this weird looking. Even weirder than normal. I feel like the video playback has to be done in a hardware mode that wouldn't register as a texture. Okay. Because writing video to texture is a much later tech thing. Oh, I see Spyro at that front table. Yeah, did he throw Spyro on there? I didn't see. Oh my god, it makes sense. <laughs> I'll get it on the other end. Sorry, it's, it's glitching out like that because we keep having our controller disconnect. It's, not... it's a DualShock 4 and they disconnect very easily. Right. If you have a stable connection with the controller, whether that's Bluetooth or USB Type-C, it won't do that. Right. Why did you let Razor Ra 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 die? Yeah, I don't know, man. Namco's messed up. Yeah, I don't... It's... They need to fix it. Them trying to outport it. Uh, what was it? They were trying to outsource it to um, Bugbear or something. No, like that Malaysia. Back. Oh yeah, Malaysia. Yeah, was... Namco Malaysia or something was working on the Ridge Racer reboot and Metroid Prime Four, and both of those they just canceled. Yeah, it's like, come on. What happened? They almost pulled a seven gen on the Switch. Yeah. Namco did. It's like Namco. I thought you got better. Oh, here we go. Yes. Here we fucking go. Yeah! Give me your best balloon smile. <laughs> oh man, I love Red Dress Type 4. It's so good. It's so good. What a great goddamn game. It's one of my favorite races they ever made. Yeah, they, they brought back Ace Combat. Come on. Bring back Ridge Racer. What's now, obviously, here? flying in a plane has more appeal than racing. Who likes racing games? No one. No one. Oh, they're saying it's Singapore, not Malaysia. Okay. okay. That, that makes sense. Just a uh, time attack. Circle. Right. You're playing a Japanese game. Yes. On the PS1 where they didn't give a fuck. Bing. You can also disable the resolution thing, but I find it pretty helpful for stuff. For anyone who's never used a mister and didn't know. I hope this song is good. Three, two, two one, one. Here it is we a good go. song. Three laps to go. We do have that on, right? Yeah. Yes. So give me one second. I'm I'm trying to scale this up a little bit. Ah, I so see. You can see it better. We can uh, poke around real quick. Nice thing about having a full full quality capture card that can do R4, uh, RGB 444 is that you can just poke around. Unfortunately, this is so small compared to the last thing. It is gone. It has disappeared. So I have to redo the super zoom mode for the PS1. Here we go. 
I don't know. That actually looks kind of nice here. Can you uh, turn it off real quick? Because yeah. I feel like the perspective actually kind of works. Oh, right. We're still doing that thing where it's a... Uh, right. So it. turn it off and then unpause. Yeah, I I kind of like I kind of like it with the uh, vertical thing. The interesting is thing is now that we're seeing it like this, right? Is that it stretches it in perspective with the texture, and since the perspective is the horizon here, mm -hmm. it actually doesn't look nearly as bad as it did. Yeah, in their standard game. Yeah, in in a, on a box we're looking at that is perfectly perpendicular to the perspective or the ray of, of uh, perspective. That's interesting. Yeah, I don't know. Interesting look. Yeah. I think it's really cool to add features like that. I'm curious if Mr. Core will get more features like that. Yeah, this guy keeps adding insane stuff like that. Let me see what it looks like it's on the car. Oh, Mizerna Falls was a PS1 game? That, that, that game looked hilarious. I don't know if we'll keep doing this for a while, though. I, I did tell people I would do Spyro and Soul Reaver, though. So <laughs> I'm going to get those in. Brighter Legacy area. of Pain Soul Reaver. Oh, of course. Full title. Come on, get out of the shadows. I just want to check this in the brightness. Here we go. You going to mess with the dithering? Yeah. Well, not dithering, the texture filter. What if you turned off the dithering and then turned on the texture well, this first. Okay. That's... For anyone who didn't know what dithering is, it doesn't... The PS1 doesn't support full 24-bit color. God, that's... So really the fun. shades, it has hard breaks in it, as you can see. Yeah, it has a fire in the sky. It has, it has a trick called dithering where it, you know, makes it look a lot more subtle as it transitions between the two. A pretty effective trick. Hey, Jack, not Jack. How's it going? I know a bunch of people just showed up from Dr. O. Uh, Jack Not Jack might also be a streamer you're interested in. Uh, lately she's been streaming um, PS1 JRPGs, currently working through the Valkyrie profile. Ooh. Finished Xenogears interest, uh, recently. I can't remember what was between the two. I was hanging out with Jack Not Jack when I, you know, posted both, finished and posted both today's, sorry, Fridays. It's no longer Friday. Uh podcast and poll for the patreon to see what people wanted to watch wanted us to watch and then they were criminal but yeah if you have a mister that's where you can go to get it um there's actually an automatic installer um i can post that link in chat give me one moment I need to open this web page and find it again okay so for anyone who has a mister who is interested in this specifically Go there, because it has all the instructions and everything. It's way better than just looking at a GitHub. It's literally made by the person who made that core. And there's <laughs> there's an automatic version. And yeah, sometimes it's really hard to parse it. It's just like, here is a GitHub. It has 100 files. Guess. <laughs> yeah, so the best thing about that, here's what I did, and I ha r highly recommend it to anyone with Mr. Use the automatic installer they have on that page. Then to get the latest version, go to the GitHub. So all you have to do to update it is replace an RBF file. It's just one file. Meanwhile, that's going to make all the directories you need. What's up? Soul Calibur poster. Oh, yeah. It's just so monochromatic. How do I... Is there no reverse? Square? Circle? Really? Wow. I never noticed. Right? I guess it never became an issue. Wrong way. When you bump that hard, I guess it is less of an issue. But yeah, he should have it public like by later this month. Yeah, that's that's rough. Hey, can you uh, turn oh, turn on the filter? Uh, sure. What's up? That's what happens. What's up? I can totally read that, right? But Soul Calibur. Uh huh. Sure. I can I can I'll read that. Play. Turn it off. What? What's up? Yeah, it's like, what are you doing, guys? It's a really cool idea. I'm gonna, it's a really cool idea. I'm going to boot up that fighting game real quick before we move on to the other drive. Yeah, of course, because the other drive isn't going to have that fighting game. No. Thank you, Helvetica scenario. 
Helvetica Zenaria, by the way, not a reference to Helvetica Standard. Okay. We confirmed that in Dr. O's chat. I was like, I was just going to walk around for the rest of my life assuming it was a Helvetica Standard, you know, Michi Joe reference. <laughs> Yo, Capcom? I heard they got that game. <laughs> my god, what is this intro cut? Quality. It does. This has to be like a special song for uh, the U.S. What gave you that idea? <laughs> oh, that was clearly going to be Chewbacca yeah, if they got the like, license. Yeah, like, it's a <laughs> Man, that was blatant. I did not expect the, this was a Star Wars game at one point to be that blatant. <laughs> These characters are getting into Star Wars. Where is their Disney Plus series? It's a look around you reference. Look around you also very good. Ooh. I do need to watch more Look Around You. I yeah. barely saw any. I think I've seen one whole episode. I hope it's on some streaming platform at this point. Okay, Legacy of Kane's on there. Let me put Spyro on there. <laughs> Very cool. Big thumbs up. Star Gladiator. Gladiator. Good job. You said the name. Now, can you say it well? No. Okay. Well, I tried. Oh my god. Sad. I don't like him. No, he's awful. Ooh, I like Geralt. Yeah, Geralt's pretty cool. Can we get him in a bathtub? <laughs> Spreading his legs. Zelkin? People who don't get the joke are like, what the fuck's wrong with that? <laughs> I don't think it's a Witcher joke. <laughs> You know, it's funny, Bob, you know, there's so many differences between this, this, uh, the OLED and the CRT, but really it just boils down to soul, no soul. <laughs> That's all it is. That's all it is. First season to look around you is available on DVD. Is it available on any streaming platform, though? I don't want to commit that hard, you know? Right. Like, I'd be more okay just renting an episode or two from Amazon Prime just to see it, you know? Right. Because I don't know. Maybe that episode I caught was really good. Okay. Oh. Yeah, this looks weird. <laughs> Every time I turn it on, I'm like, this is a weird idea. It's just a weird thing you've done. Yeah, I always thought it looked strange in Unreal Engine 1, but my optimism here was about how bad the PS1 looks when it comes to this stuff. Right. But largely, the PS1's problems... It's showing your combos up there. I never noticed. See the word plasma? Yeah. When you attack, it fills it with what attacks you use. Weird. That's interesting. The whole season is like an hour. Oh my god. <laughs> I remembered it being short, but it was so long ago that I watched it. I can't believe it's that short. Okay, so it was Soul Reaver Spyro. Was there another one I said I would do that we forgot? I don't think so. This just looks like a, an area that they fight in in a... God, what is it? Evil Zone. Edits Vodju. Like, this looks like that specific bridge in the background going overhead. Yeah, but now we got a sci-fi city in the background. It's flying cars. So different. It's a different Detroit. It's a, it's a future dirty Detroit. Yes. Very cool. Are you playing deadly if he had a sword? Yeah, you, you we really are. Scarliata says, no, Han Solo, if he were old Errol Flynn. Yeah, Rim Rimgol is a very cool uh, name for a dinosaur. Why is there a dinosaur? I don't know why there's a dinosaur. <laughs> so weird. We were really big into just shove a dinosaur in this fighting game back then. Yeah, yeah, that, that, yeah. That, that just happened. Ready. Someday Gun will make his return to Tekken. Oh yeah, and for anyone who missed it, this uh, this core can do widescreen. You do that because yeah. that's actually cool as hell. Keep going. There, there we, we go. go. Why'd you turn to it? Yeah, yeah no, sixteen by nine PS one game goodness. Right? That's crazy, right? Pretty cool to me. But yeah, I think that's everything I've got. Okay. So we switch in or was there yeah, something else on this? Good. Whenever you're good. 
feel like we threw something else on this that we wanted to try, but maybe. Uh, if you want to look around, feel free. I'm in no rush. Oh, there's Ape Escape if you wanted to try that, because I know you're talking about yeah, I did wanna, I did want to see that specifically. Ape Escape. There was a teeth Tekken 3 tournament about 18 hours ago that had a loser's finals gone. <laughs> That's great. Uh, okay, I was like, maybe Ape Escape's not gonna boot. <laughs> that was a very interesting. You gotta get that. Oh, analog. I can just hit the touch screen, right? You added that? Maybe you didn't add that. Looks like he hasn't added that yet. Dang. Ooh. The rumble support stuff is in though, right? That's what they say. Okay. Yeah, okay. I guess the dinosaur would have been the Gamorrean guard. I don't know what that is. Pig guard? Pig guard? Yeah, it's from a Jabba's palace. They're pigs. See, I you say it right, yeah. and I'm like, yeah, that would be there. I don't remember what that fucking looked like. I watched I watched episode three once <laughs> when I was an adult. You mean six? Oh yeah, yeah, I do mean six. I, God, I wish I only saw episode three. Well, actually, wait. No, I've seen episode three multiple times, like twice. That's too many. <laughs> I think everyone can agree on that. Are they hard to come by right now? I thought that Mr. Stolen Socks, but I guess it would make sense that there would be a rush on them now that the PlayStation Star is happening. Yeah, I mean, I know even just our streams have gotten people more interested. Right. Hey, Dan, what's your favorite PS... What's your favorite PS1... What's your favorite PlayStation Sony franchise? Ape Escape 1 is such a good game. Yeah. Yeah, it's really good. It, it's, its successors don't even live up to how good it is. It was like a surprisingly competent 3D platformer in that era. Like it and Mario are the two big ones. Yeah. That monkey had a gun. Yes, yes he did. That's kind of the theme of the game. It's just in a sense. That city's really jagged now. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, it looks a little bit better like that. Yeah, it's like, this is a neat idea, but oh man. Oh, but only bad. when your assets are very specifically designed around it. Right. Which no, none of them are. Hello, I'm a child. <laughs> Sorry, one of them has a kind of deeper hey, voice. Spike. Did the professor finish the time station yet? That does not sound like time? a child. I'm he sorry. He finished with it today. Let's go. I can't wait to check out the dinosaurs. That oh, monkey has a blank is we'll the whole game. Yeah. That's not fair. Uh, I think that was Ape Escape 3, but it might have been 2 that had Snake. Yeah, I think it was 3. I think you're right. Hey, professor. I believe that was Ubisoft. Spike, Jake, over here. Watch out. Uh, Spike, bring it to the US. So dubbing him. Not getting the guy. No. No. Not like this. No! What are you doing? Shoot! <laughs> yeah, the texture filtering, hard pass. The data cache so it runs every game better. Big Spike feature. Me. Oh, yeah. For anyone who doesn't know. Um... Come on, Cleo. What's wrong with the US voices? We got the freaking Pokemon cast. Yeah. <laughs> data cache. Uh, so it has a cache for the CPU. This is a feature the PS1 didn't have. It didn't have a cache for the CPU. You turn this on and your performance goes up in a lot of games. Something awful has happened. Which is awesome. That is really neat. The time station has been activated by Spectre. You're being transported. I'm surprised this effect works perfectly fine in widescreen. Yeah. Huh. Medita. They're not as good as the PAL voice, no. They're much better. <laughs> yeah, so widescreen. Ape Escape is a game that definitely with widescreen just you can see it cutting off the polygons. Like look look right. at the wall. Right. Yeah, cuz it's designed in a way where it's same. trying to show as little as possible. Right. That's not on screen. Do 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 do. 
I'm sure I'm sure I'll turn this filtering on and I'll be like, now it's perfect. Yeah, it looks perfect, Bob. How how dotted do you like your grass? Very dotted. What if no dots? Hmm. The Not sky so sure. bad. <laughs> What if, what if we could set a flag where every sky in every video game used dithering but nothing else? <laughs> that'd be no, that'd, neat. That'd be fantastic. I'll be right back. This is the future of video games. We're going to start cutting off polygons closer into the view to save performance. We're going to ray trace video games, but then um, anything that's too close to the edge, we're just going to we're going to make it flatly lit to save on performance. Is that breaking the cookies? No, the mister is. Interesting. You guys see that, right? Up on the left? The, the cookies are broken. Gotcha! Yeah, the rumble. That rumble was really accurate. Wow. That's actually, that's actually really impressive. I need to make sure I get uh, some fresh Dual Shock Fours before they stop producing them because they, they're very hey, Abson's Castle. Thank, thank you so much for the ball. Um, I need to make sure I do that because it's a different thing from the Dual Sense. Like I really like the Dual Sense controller, but if I'm playing PS1 games, I want that D-pad to feel angled in the same sort of way. Hopefully, someday they can get the PS1 controller compatible with this. So far, they haven't. Keep in mind, any USB controller should work. Okay, yeah. Any USB controller can be set up, but on other consoles on the Mister, you can actually uh, use the original controller. I thought I already followed months ago. It's okay. That happens. See, on one hand, I'm like, I don't usually have that problem. But then I thought about it, and I was like, that just means I never found the stream burn again. You did great. You did great. The closest thing I had to that recently is I realized I didn't follow Jack Not Jack on Twitter. I think I follow most people I watch on Twitch on Twitter. Hey, Bob. Hey. Did you know Ape Escape's fucking good and I would easily just put Ape Escape Month again on the good side list just to be like, I tried. <laughs> Can't blame me for trying. <laughs> Look what I've got. A new gadget. Check it out. Everyone who came this over ought to fall if they have it already. This is like one of the most unique streams on the internet. Well, thank you, Scarliana. Scarliana actually right now. watched us Try way back when we first started Without streaming. Uh, did you know Dr. O also started well, with Mega Man Maker? Did like, you know Dr. O also streamed Mega Man Maker just like we did? Because <laughs> that's how we got our start. Uh, uh, start streaming, which is nuts. Right. No one would blame me for sneaking in Dan. No, they'd be like, Dan's so smart and so brave. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Trying to trick his viewers to letting him have a second ape escape. <laughs> By the way, uh, I don't know how familiar you are with the feel of ape escape, but this, this rumble's perfect. They nailed it. When you get into the water, uh, just click in the stick, but then hit the shoulders, the R buttons to kick the paddle. That oh. feels exactly right. That does feel pretty familiar. That feels spot on. It's kind of crazy. There we go. There we go. <laughs> no other streams play 10 hours of the land and then go straight into an ape escape playthrough. Exactly. Wait a second. We're second we're trying to trick you. Besides, we can't do an ape escape playthrough because I gotta go get donuts and uh. Because re remember, I'm not buying a car. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually buying fourteen thousand dollars worth of donuts. On what time? Is it? Ooh, wait, okay. wait. This is actually a really good use case for the uh, filter. Oh yeah. Yeah, because there's like some color banding over here, and who knows? Maybe that'll fix it. Let me hit this. We can look down at it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Like five thirty in the morning. No, does not fix it. No. In fact, somehow makes it worse. Because it's more apparent how wavy it is. Uh-huh. I feel like that's more apparent how wavy it is. Maybe I'm insane. Let me turn dithering on. Okay, the dithering almost covers it completely because that's its job. Right. Excuse me. Yeah, yeah, I feel like it's, it's just better without it. 
Yeah, yeah. This but here's the thing. If we could find a way to fix that. Yeah, yeah. If we could fix that. The classic PS1 perspective correct textures problem. That would be the shit. That'd be pretty insane. It'd be like, it would be weird because we wouldn't be looking at a PS1 game anymore. No, but it would be great because it means it would have fall. Man, this is an awesome way to play this game. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just like, I'm dumbfounded as it's like, this controller feels exactly as the, the PS1 one did. Oh, it's hey, a Ray. DualShock 4 and it's widescreen now. And I'm just, I'm, I'm alive. Any good games tonight? Well, I'm most of tonight was playing the Land, Land Wonder, Wonder World. World, which is the fucking worst. Yeah, the it's like a two. Out, it's it's like a three or a four out of ten at best. Yeah, every idea in it's dumb. It's it's greatest claim to fame. Okay, it's best quality as as a game is it's not overly frustrating to play, except yeah. for the quick time events, yeah, which are thing, horrible. The best thing you can say about it is it's not hard. Yeah. You know you got a real quality experience there. When right. That's the best thing you can say. But okay. Um. Hey, Bob. Can you turn it off and switch SSDs, yeah. and then we'll do the last two games. Our soccer. It's just brain death. The game form. Dan is detoxing on the good shit. Yes. R uh, Rig says he's never heard of Blan. Oh, good for him. To, to explain why we're streaming that rig. I can actually start doing oh. things faster because the CRT lets me see before the, the OLED pops up or the capture card. You okay? Yeah, I just, I think my, my toes cramped up from sitting this long. <laughs> you just need to do what rig does. What's that? Uh, stop eating entirely. Drink turmeric. <laughs> Drink turmeric. <laughs> Return to turmeric. Okay, so we got a lot of people from Dr. O here. Also follow Retro Island Gaming, please. Another one of my top four streams I watched. Right, right here. Hello? Are you okay? It's just... Oh, because I, I put pressure down in, oh. the, in the spot where That's the electric... That's my Dan! <laughs> <laughs> in the part where the electrical wiring is... Shake around in his chair a lot. Yeah, that's the thing, we Bob. We need to be shot more often. Here, I'll just, I'll simulate it. Stop, El Dorado. No, no, no. <laughs> okay, there. there. Now just do that every 30 minutes on the dot. <laughs> what are we actually? Okay, there. Where did, is, oh, Legacy like, of, Kane, of Kane, Soul, Soul Reaver. Reaver. God, every time. Yeah, we'll we'll boot that first since Riggs here, and he just he just played this. You beat that on that stream, right? <laughs> Eating sardines in the kitchen—that's the trick, Bob. Drink turmeric on stream. Eat sardines in the kitchen. Oh my god! When I describe it like that, it's like I'm depicting some depraved human being. <laughs> Everything about falling asleep while watching Gigaboots is waking up to stop El Dorado! No, no, no! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> not working right. No, this is clearly not working right. Yeah, because we had all those. Lists. I'm just going to reboot the mister. I feel like we're having more problems today than we had on any other PS1 roulette for this. I got the last boss left on Soul Reaver. Okay, Oof. so you got all the way to him. I assume that that's a nightmare then. <laughs> um, are you using oh, a guide? God. I'm curious. Oh, God, Bob, we should probably add that as a, as a theme mod to, to the evil side. Okay, I was like, it better be the evil side. Those games are cool, really cool, like stylistically. Mm-hmm. Lots of neat story stuff. Yeah. Every one of them is a different kind of nightmare to play. Legacy of Kane just doesn't work, at very least on today's build. This is from today, by the way, for anyone who didn't realize. Right. Uh, yeah, I'm really interested in having... That's Soul Blade, Dan. You don't get to play Soul Blade every time you put in... You have to, you have to play Spyro, Dan. You don't get to play Soul Blade. Nobody wants to see Soul Blade. Um... Okay, Rushenberg. 
all of Soul Reaver is a puzzle that doesn't give you any answers to and expects you to figure out. That's really good. I like. Did you do this, Ted? The 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 lens flare and the distortion. That's really cool. You never told me you had a passion for graphic design. Isn't there supposed to be music? Not every one of those PS2 ones is just super jank. But yeah, you are right. I there. accidentally chose Spyro 3. Aww. It's like, this is wrong. The Blood Omen 1 2 are definitely the worst. It's, it's really clear. <laughs> <laughs> I was bugging love this game, though, so, you know, get somebody happy. <laughs> All the dragons are dead. Yeah. Ugh. It is crazy going back to these and seeing just really good animation on the PS1. Yeah. Yeah, that's the best part about the PS1. It's like, when you realize what they went through. Thank you, Master Christmas. Seriously, it's so flattered to get followed by all these people from Dr. O'Stream that I hang out with over there. Um, but, uh, when you realize how much of a nightmare it is to make anything work on the PS1, like, the tools are so rudimentary, mm -hmm. it's technically not as rough as, a, say, a PS3, right? Right. But it's such a primitive thing, you, you really just respect it. But here's what we're going to do. We're going to make it widescreen, and it's going to look weird. We're not going to give it any respect. Oh, it's over. Oh, wait, no, it's just pausing. Wait, no. Yeah, we don't have to pause. We managed to capture the eggs, your highness. Every last one. Excellent. Maybe you will amount to something after all. Now. Yeah, we only played the remake. She looks Stop so different in the from remake. Coming she does. Through. This one's like, we drew a dragon with eyelashes. It's a woman. She's evil. The new one is like, we designed a fucking character. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I, those remakes are really good. Like, they are... They, yeah, they, they were super impressive too, and I, that was I a think, fun way to play them. But I, I, I still think it'd be worse going through the original version. Well, just a no. Oh, what's up? It looked so out of it. Just like, came out on the uh, other side of the he's like, world. just woke we up. We're too heavy to carry back. The other side of the world? The forgotten worlds. Spyro. You'll See the texture design in this. It really actually kind of works for. Yeah, come on, let's just go. Just I thought it was Lance Reddick. <laughs> My god, Spy Spyro. The Guardians. <laughs> yeah, I think we finally went Find back and finished three. And bring them back, Spyro. Yeah, yeah, so yeah we did. It, we chance. made a joke about, we like, we, we took... What was it? We took a, a break, like, for a week. We make a joke at the beginning of that playthrough saying yes. that, and it's been... It's like, Dan, it's been two and a half years. Right. Or one and a half, or almost two. That was actually really great fun. If anyone's never played like the Spyro games, those remakes are actually pretty good. They look real nice. Yeah, I don't know. I think the texture filtering actually kind of works for how they design the textures in Spyro. It definitely is less hideous than it has been in other games. Yeah, because here you see the seams a lot more, I feel. Whereas you put that on and it sort of just blends together. Let me look at the wall though. Yeah, it kind of just blurs it so it doesn't pop as much. Yeah. On an actual CRT, the difference on the wall isn't that much. It's still there, but the difference on the ground is pretty significant. I don't know. The moral of the story is, I don't know. What if I turned off dithering? What would you do then? No, it's okay, uh, Terrace. All that Vicarious Visions wasn't sentenced to the COD mines. They were sentenced to the Blizzard mines. Which, which is worse. Yeah, actually, it is worse. I don't know. Because <laughs> we don't really know what Blizzard's making other than Overwatch 2. And I feel really bad if they had to make Overwatch 2. Oh, At that, least that, anyone that enjoys COD. What's up? That the Adele before, allegedly. <laughs> They yeah, fired the, the Diablo, entire staff. They maybe fired they, the everyone, but they'll find a new everyone. I was like, maybe the Vicarious Visions literally is like, no, now we have to make because they fired everyone. <laughs> that would kind of rule, but... Yeah. Let's take out all of these awful things, like constant, always online. 
Uh, I mean, the problem is they worked on the uh, remake. They did. And that had always unlocked. Just have to. Yeah, that was one of the main reasons why we were like, no, that's fucking insane. I want to start a character on single player and then go online with it. I don't want it to be locked to one or the other and require always online. Oh, yeah, you're, you're right. It's like, I was wrong with Toys for Bob that was working on Spider. Yes. Yeah. I just thought we were talking about Activision shit. Yeah, in general. I thought we were just going to talk about Activision shit from Star Trek. <laughs> the Toys for Bob was absorbed into the Cotton Mines line. Or maybe so it was Rapture Crash the one 4. In yeah, because the they worked on huh? Crash 4. <laughs> How sad. Look here, Dragon. If you know what's good for you, you'll turn around and crawl back up that hole you came Look, through. Look, maybe I'm a stooge. Those eggs belong to us now. But her design, and in even here, is kind of cute, and I'm kind years. of surprised. Besides, yeah, no, they actually achieved it. Egg, yeah, I feel like on. this angle isn't the most flattering on her character model, <laughs> but... I was shocked she wasn't just the absolute most lifeless thing possible. Because for anyone who hasn't seen what the difference between the remake and the original for the kangaroo is. Yeah, I was also going to bring up the kangaroo. It was <laughs> like, it's just the kangaroo. Nothing else is happening. Yeah, but now they sexualized it. I'm like, no, now it seems like a character and has big legs because it's a kangaroo. And they're like, oh, God, there's that guy. Oh, God. I'm what, horrified. What, what, him? Yeah, him. No, nah, it's cool. Just just remember the Shibuya image of him getting strangled. <laughs> Do I still have that? Let me check if I have that drawing from Shibuya of this dude just getting absolutely strangled. And the audio stopped. Oh, we're wrapping back around. My mind to the toys for Bob is just the star control people. Wow. I have no, no idea. Feels like everyone who was struggling ended up in, like, Star Control for... Well, no, no, I'm thinking Star Citizen. Oh, okay. Star Control. Oops. Phil Spencer's surely gonna save them. Sure knows in Microsoft as they're sure. Yeah. It's yeah. Definitely, uh... I like how this week, we didn't even cover it on Big Thing, but it's like, all oh, the investors approved of this transaction that would benefit them greatly. It's like, yeah, no of course shit. they did. That doesn't matter. We're waiting on the FTC to maybe stop this. But but just so you know, we're all down for making a shitload of money. We we actually love these paychecks. Uh, really? I told them you wouldn't. They asked me a moment ago. They were like, Are those guys going to really enjoy having giant paychecks? And I was like, no. Nah. <laughs> okay, Bob, bad news. What's up? Bad news, guys. I couldn't find the Shibuya strangling him image, but I did find... Oh, no. I did find the other... Fire him up image. <laughs> we may have run him into the wall a few too many times during that stream. We probably did that, yeah. Fire will never be the same again. Oh man, remember good 3D platformers and how that's absolutely nothing like Volant? Yes! I actually was viscerally aware of that all night. Like, literally nothing like it. <laughs> so, Bob, okay, which one do you want? Look at the, the yellow green circle. Uh huh. Which. I don't like the yellow green. It's like whatever, but the, the regular grass looks a lot better without it. Mm. Cause I can see like a texture on it. I like that. I you like, like textures? I like seeing oh the textures. Oh my god! I, I I brought it back down and now I'm looking at it up again. <laughs> he just watches. It's truly terrible, and I wish he would stop. And I've asked him to leave, but he won't. <laughs> It's not like we just heard two of Microsoft Studios are on fire right now. That didn't happen, right? Yeah, of course not. Why we don't hear about how a new a studio is on fire every week from Microsoft? We literally cut news from Big Think Dimension this week, where it was like Halo's still not going to do the thing they said they were going to do. They won't. Wait. They couldn't even possibly do it for the next five months. <laughs> it's like, yeah, no, actually it's seven because it's November. I saw and I'm like, I'm like, Jesus Christ. Yeah, and we had a conversation about, like, some people think we dunk on Microsoft too much, so we're like, okay, stop bringing them up when the news is they shit their pants again. <laughs> if we stop bringing them up when that happens, there will be less dunking. Well, Bob, I can't find that image. Oh, wow. I will probably find it whenever we stop. 
It would help if I remember his name. Let's talk to him. Maybe we'll remember Yo, his Spyro. name. Yo, Spyro. I just found one of those portal thingamajigs that leads to a different world. See, but in this version, he looks like a dude who smokes to too it. much weed. Press the X yeah. button to jump. Then press the X button again while you're in the air to glide. Why does Spyro use hey, button? That helped. Oh my god. What's <laughs> up, dude? What the heck? <laughs> That's how small he is. <laughs> Ooh, baby. <laughs> He's got clamp proportions. God. <laughs> oh, that's too good. That's too good. I like how it looks like Bob's falling asleep, but it's that the monitor's down there because I yes. have to move it out of the way and see it too. Hunter, enter the dragonfly sounds like this. Oh, no. Yeah, Dio, the, the insane part of that Battle Royale thing is like still 12 people. You can't, it's, it's calling that Battle Royale is just comical. Oh, yeah, no, that's farcically overselling. Here's our MMO. It's eight player. Star Control 2 is a crutch, by the way. So yeah, Star Control actually is really cool. Uh, that's where some of Riggs' iconic sound come from, if I'm not mistaken. Oh wow, the lighters aren't loaded at all. I saw something shiny in that cave over there. Let's right, go check it out. Perspective. Oh really? Yeah. So if you like that door, they just disappear. Way harsh of it. Yeah. I guess those are very fancy. So they don't want to do it. Oh, the lighters. Yeah. 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 A lot of things actually pop in at about that range. Yeah. Insomniac's whole thing is that they were actually renowned for having like infinite draw of distance because you know not a lot of ps1 games do this like ape escape doesn't do this yeah yeah it is you do see quite a ways and it looks cleaner and longer yeah which you can see a lot of limitations in some of the assets and stuff because of that <laughs> but you can see so far into the distance it's kind of like right like, the texture definitely look worse but I see an egg at the bottom of this lake. Egg. I would go get it, but I don't want to get. I my have Valan poisoning. Maybe you. I can't can get sit it. here can and hear on. egg and not think of how we kept collecting eggs and we beat that game and we have no idea yeah. what the point. Yeah, no, that, that got some more. I think that got more Tim's. The, I didn't oh, they were literally eggs for Tim's. Yeah. <laughs> Blow and dance vines here. How many players do you need before it's, it's massive? 10? 20? I mean, you definitely need more than 8. <laughs> yeah. I would say you can't call it a massive game unless it's at least 30 players. I think that's fair. I think anyone who says otherwise is probably bending over backwards to defend Destiny and nothing else. <laughs> yeah. That's the only human being who would sit there and be like, hey, what, what do you got against games with 24 players? Why aren't those massive multiplayer games? And I'm like... Because you've described every FPS ever. Right? Call of Duty Modern Warfare, the MMO. <laughs> obviously, though, to be definitively massive, you need to be 256 like Mag. <laughs> yeah, obviously. The massive action game. Here I was, about to go for a nice swim at Shell Beach, and my portal just disappeared. He's got a little right shell on his collar. If Very you go cute. find some more of those dragon eggs, I bet this portal would turn on again. 14 nerd, nerd, nerd. Yeah, those remakes of this were really good. Yeah. Yeah, I actually didn't know about Toys for Bob making Star Control until, like, the credits, I think. Reg was playing it or someone else was. Yeah. And it was just like, it was made by Toys for Bob, and I'm like, oh, fucking rip. <laughs> yeah, right? Uh, anyway, I think we're good here. Um, let's, let's see. Is there anything else you wanted to see? We've been streaming quite a while. Yeah, I don't like. It would just where, be us playing the game. I know. Really. It's like it, it just looks bad. Like the the sector filter isn't good at all. So I'm like, it's not that exciting. <laughs> no, it really is just. Hey, Bob, do you want an excuse to do a round in Soul Blade? One guy just is again. <laughs> no, don't do that. Jesus. God, no, that was. Dr. O is probably not here, but Twin Goddesses is, is a game. Dr. It's, O it's should a, play. It's a Dr. O core game. 100%. Yes. Um, but yeah, I'd be fine 100%. with playing or, or watching the intro to Soul Blade. I think everyone would love to see that. No, no one likes the intro to Soul Blade. It's not like a national anthem for gamers. 
That was Castlevania. Really fucky, actually. No, yeah, that's that surprisingly show. one of the few things the Cordes couldn't handle. Yeah. <laughs> Twin goddesses shot me a sick of flailing. <laughs> yes. One sec. Transcending history there it is. and the world, a tale of soul Quiet. and swords. Not for them. Okay, okay. I yeah. have them turned up. Us, though, however. Hey, Bob. Hey. The sound system won't turn up. You know why? Oh, hey, I like that. Sound system's muted. It's behind that monitor. There we go. Yeah, no one likes this song. Nobody. The, wait, this is where Max's opening is from? I wish I could count all the Zoomers I've heard that from. I actually don't know if Alphonse is a Zoomer, I'm just guessing. Shooting from the hip here. Right. So carry on. A really what good a good song. song. What a good song. Remember what? when intros were this? Yeah, it's like, why doesn't Full Cover 6 have this? Dude, I don't know. Like, just just get some ham, like, anime opening. People love it. Remember when Street Fighter 4 did that? Yeah, that was great. And then 5 did it. That was great. Too hot for Twitch. You can see those nips here on the mister. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> yeah, follow for this. <laughs> Thank you, Kaiju Dragoon. Oh, I guess I should grab that. What? Oh, yeah, sure. So we can actually play. Just don't. Soul Calibur 6 has no budget. No, that game is clearly very expensive. I really, it just will not let me adjust the volume from back out here. This is just what we're stuck with. Well, I saw what, what I wanted to. At least you have a good night. Hope you're able to rest after Yuji Daka's tournament. I'm going to sleep like a fucking baby. Welcome to the stage of Welcome. I want to eat donuts. No donuts. <laughs> yes, that is the problem. Did we want to throw on 16 by 9? Sure. Okay, well, we should still land on whatever our character is because it's probably going to time out. And... Yeah. Okay, well, I, I'm good just with it selecting me whenever it's ready. Okay. We're going to turn on texture filter because we're deviants. <laughs> what if it made the defocus thing? Actually, it doesn't even affect that. Weird. What? So those are 2D and they look that way. Okay, whatever. <laughs> we, we all learned something today. Battle one, fight. It was very convincing. White screen didn't ruin the illusion at all. <laughs> I wonder if we'll ever get another full caliber. They have to. Because it's like the, the dude who brought it back and was in charge of all that. Well, yeah, I know. It's worrisome. Hopefully. The grueling battle, still love that with the of the grueling battle ended. If anyone wise wonders why I uh, fidget in my chair so much, it's because my house that I will move out of next month, this house I'm renting, uh, is uneven so much, and it feels like it's getting worse every day, uh, that I am... My chair slowly spins. Yes. I, 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 this, this is such a, such a bizarre thing. I see no one else on Twitch have this problem, but it's embarrassing. Yeah, of course, that's not, not the major thing I'm worried about. Right. I'm worried about the electricity being unstable. Which may be ca caused by the, uh, spouse the part sinking of the, into the, uh, the house is slipping off the, the, the one <laughs> place they found in Florida to build it on. I know, isn't that funny? 
I would have posted more information about this house just to show people, but I'm, I'm going to wait till we move. Right. Right? We should just film a lot of stuff being like, yeah, this is where we were living. I mean, uh, you can see part of the, the backyard and stuff in the, uh, the, the Xbox destruction video, but not the Yeah, but you don't part. get... I feel like you don't get the full image of just how stark that cliff is. Yeah. The well, I, battle ends with the victory of Big Free. You win. I never had such an easy victory. Easy victory. <laughs> Welcome to the I never had history. such an easy victory. We're going with Sophia. <laughs> now, Bob, What's here's how I know I have a taste. Okay? Yeah. yeah. A preference? Yes. Hit the X button to select, and I'm like, no, why would you ruin life? <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with you? <laughs> oh, I love the announcer. Fight is classic. Oh, look at the fucking outfit I got! Yeah, she's got a good hat, this one. And she's got, like, a, a kilt-looking skirt. Right. Day-night cycles, how fucking raw! Fucking raw! Stab. Oh, no! No, don't stab me on the floor! The grueling battle ended in a kind of grotesque manner. I will never forget you. I will never forget you. You that guy stabs in the head 37 times. He's like, oh, hot. <laughs> oh, that's hot. Blow it up at you. Jesus. Stop it. No! Need to find some way to stab you on the ground. We gotta, we gotta bring the weekly meeting back. Especially now that we have a P PS1 Mister. Right. Court. That, that's too cool. There we go. Oh. No, no, no. Nice. No. Yeah. The ruling battle ended with the victory of Mitsurugi. You win. Final battle, fight! Yeah, I like her, I like her boots. Her knee-high boots here. Yeah, they're oh, real a good cool. choice. Oh. Ah! Oh no. It was like, it was fucking... I wish Soul Calibur 6 was, wasn't so low budget. I'm like, what are you talking about? Her boobs alone cost probably 13 mil. <laughs> Damn it. You win. That, that's bullshit. That clearly doesn't count. I was thinking about Soul Calibur 6 Sophia boobs. Now, <laughs> cheating, I see. That's not on me. Bob cheated. Soundtrack. Yeah, it does. Namco soundtracks. Yeah, Namco sound team was incredible. Battle one. Fight. I mean, this song is one of the best in this game. No, my weapon's lost. Oh my god, I forgot that was a thing in this game. Oh no, he's still gonna kick me. It's gonna be really embarrassing. The grueling battle ends with the victory of Li Long. You win. Li Long? Li Long? He sounded very confused. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, Li are you sure? Fight. Am I reading this right? No! No, get up! No! Yeah! Look at that exceptional hit range! Let's look at that again! That was so. You <laughs> win! Jesus. Welcome to the stage of history. Trying to think. We have Mitsurugi in this game and not Arthur. God, I forgot to do that. It's insane. Wait. In like European regions? Like, no, we can't have a, a samurai. That's too violent. If you want, I can drop the European version. 
I don't hold blame because I have never seen Arthur. Yeah, it's probably horrible. Yes, sir, the practice. I wonder. It feels like the plate's already so full for fighting games. Like we're getting a ton of good stuff already, but I'm still like, but I, I want, I want to see actual games with Street Fighter Six. I want to see Tekken Eight get announced. That was a close match. I had no health bar. No, you did. Uh, yeah, DNF Duel is so exciting. I'm so excited for DNF Duel. Yeah, it's cool. gonna rule. No! There we go. No! Guys, we're like, don't touch me. Go on her. Oh, he first showed up in the Korean version of Soul Calibur. Oh, so that's what it was. I might have. I don't know. But yeah, that's Soul Calibur, not not Soul Blade. Yeah. That's interesting. Yeah, I couldn't remember exactly what reason I had to do that for, so I thought it was zero. Well, you know, someday I do need to get the Korean version of, uh... Oh, that was disastrous. <laughs> that was bad, Jesus. I, I do need to get the Korean version of, uh... And Tony Hawk someday, so that way I can play as that K-pop fan. Welcome to I feel bad about talking about Sure. I like Taki. I'm not sure that I played her a whole lot in one. No. Soul Blade. Oh, yeah, I don't think I did either. Oh wow, there's two different outfits. Like, like that's three outfits totally we've seen so far for Taki. Yeah, this is one of the vacuum sealed butt. <laughs> Tosh, Tosh had never seen Metal Gear Solid 4. Uh -huh. So she's coping with Old Snake's butt cheeks vacuum sealed. <laughs> she's just like, Jesus! What is with that ass? I'm like, if it makes you feel better, I think the, the muscle suit has a literal muscle suit. Yeah, it's actually it literally has, robotic butt cheeks. It has nanotech fibers for muscles. It's not just all old man ripped as shit butt. She's like, okay. I was looking at the texture filter on the CRP, so, you know. Doesn't count. Doesn't count. I was thinking of Mini, so. <laughs> the winning battle ended with the victory of Taki. You win. Kiana. I turned Dithery off, didn't I? No, it is on. It just looks like that. Okay, sure. <laughs> well, I think I think we're good. Welcome I think we did yeah, a good yeah, stream. On, we got to cleanse our palate at the end with some Soul Blade. I want to thank Dr. O for streaming, uh, Rig for hanging out, uh... Dr. O for rating. What? You said Dr. O, you were saying Dr. O for streaming, but no, it's Dr. O for rating. Thing. Yeah, thank you for rating. <laughs> and the, 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 it, 13 and a half hours, I get a pass. If you think otherwise, go fuck yourself. <laughs> uh... It's only Snake's face age super fast, man. Fox Dog's just mean. That would be funny with the case, but no. It is not the case. <laughs> no, it is not. Uh, thank you all for hanging out. Let's go find someone on Twitch. Someone's got to be live. Dr. Who went live again. <laughs> God, that would be funny. We just keep passing back and forth. I told you we got to start these streams at noon so that way, you know, Rick can pass them to us and then we'll stream long enough to pass them back to Ray. <laughs> it's like sickos. <laughs> I'm gonna find somebody new. One moment. Check out the retro tag. And Twitch, you better not be doing that thing where you hide people I follow from me. Because <laughs> it's done that a couple times and it's really upset me because I'll just finish the stream and I'll be like, this person was streaming, but they didn't have enough views, so I didn't, I didn't feel like showing them. I'm like, why are you like that? I, I hate I hate people getting a, a new 
new view views, viewers. I hate it when, when small channels get people watching. Why do you like this? Okay, I know what we're gonna do. We're gonna raid Fractal Mind Mike. Find a game I've never heard of before, but it looks like I like the cut of that game's jib. So we're gonna go over there. We have nothing to say. There's no raid message. I am sorry, guys. Yeah, it's too late. <laughs> My brain's not thinking. No, no retro streamer wants to hear about Yuji Naka being tried in front of the court of gamers. Right, no. We're just gonna head over there. And me and Bob are gonna head to Dunkin' and get maybe a good donut. And then we're gonna go sleep. And it's gonna be great. Once again, thank you all for hanging out. Thanks thank so you much. everyone who supported via watching or just hanging out. And uh, especially the people who put in too much money. But uh, stop that. 